On Monday, we predicted that Brent futures would end the week trading between $86 and $87 a barrel. And January is currently trading around $87 a barrel handles. And we are heading towards our second consecutive week on week loss. So what happened? We've been seeing peaks and troughs during the week, range bound between 85 and failing to maintain any strength above 87. Despite Israel's grand invasion of Gaza over the weekend, prices are back to where they were prior to Hamas's attacks on October the 7th. The RSI is at 50. The market is hands off and absorbing news, good or bad. The Fed meeting struck an optimistic tone as Powell left rates unchanged while signaling an end to the tightening cycle. A little support was seen on Thursday as the dollar weakened in anticipation of this news. Manufacturing PMIs from the Eurozone and China indicated contraction, but this was absorbed and so was the build of 774,000 barrels in US inventories, which was smaller than expected. Open interest is about 100 million barrels lower than we saw in the prompt this time last month, and the market is very risk off and lacks further. A strong performance in the product allowed for an improvement of over a dollar in the December refinery margins. This was buoyed by EBOB and gas oil and helped by the weaker flat price.